classical crescendo. Francesco Durante, 1684-1755. Early life. Francesco Durante was born on March 31, 1684, in Frata Maggiore, a small town near Naples, Italy. His parents were poor, and his father was a musician who taught him the basics of music. At a young age, Durante showed great promise as a musician, and his father sent him to study with the best teachers in Naples. Education and early career Durante studied with the leading composers of his time, including Gaetano Greco and Alessandro Scarlatti. He also studied the organ with Francesco Provenzale. In 1708, he became Kapellmeister at the Conservatory of Santa Maria of Loreto, where he taught and composed music for more than 30 years. Music Compositions Durante was a prolific composer, and his works include operas, oratorios, cantatas, and instrumental music. His most famous composition is the Magnificat, a choral setting of the biblical text. He also wrote music for the church, including masses, motets, and hymns. Teaching career Durante was a renowned teacher and trained many famous composers, including Giovanni Paisiello, Niccolò Giomelli, and Leonardo Leo. He taught at several institutions, including the Conservatory of Sant'Anavrio, the Conservatory of Santa Maria of Loreto, and the Royal College of Music in Naples. Legacy Durante's music was highly regarded in his time and influenced many composers who came after him. He was particularly influential in the development of the Neapolitan School of Music, which dominated Italian music in the 18th century. His teaching methods also had a lasting impact, and his students went on to become some of the most famous composers of the time. Death and Honors Durante died on September 30, 1755, in Naples. He was honored with a funeral at the Conservatory of Santa Maria of Loreto, where he had spent most of his career. His music continued to be performed and admired long after his death, and he is remembered as one of the greatest composers of the Baroque era. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.